Political attacks on both sides of the aisle are nothing new, but Vice President Harris has faced one involving a term that's being thrown around a lot lately. Some Republicans have claimed she's only on the ticket because of diversity, equity, or an inclusion, or DEI. Uh, I think she was a DEI hire, and I think that that's what we're seeing. I agree with what the President of the United States, President Biden, said about it. He, he actually said that, that it was DEI. But here's the thing, President Biden never said that. During the 2020 campaign, he did say that he would like to pick an African-American woman as his running mate, but never called her a DEI pick. This is also the first campaign cycle where we have seen this specific term used as an attack. If you all can remember, one of the first times that this happened was in May, after the collapse of the Key Bridge, when Baltimore's Mayor Brandon Scott was branded the DEI mayor on social media. So he responded by saying, quote, we know what these folks really want to say a sentiment echoed by some Democratic lawmakers and leaders. We all recognize what people mean when they say DEI now, right? And it, is, uh, it has become a safe way of basically using a racial slur against black folks. We are going to make sure that the American people understand who is the party of intolerance, who is a party uh, th that is uh, anti-diversity in this nation. So on Tuesday, Speaker of the House Mike Johnson was asked if it was appropriate for his colleagues to criticize Harris by using DEI he had this to say. Um, listen, this election, as I noted at the outset, is going to be about policies, not personalities. Um, this is not personal with regard to Kamala Harris and her, her uh, ethnicity or her gender. It had nothing to do with this whatsoever. So since last year, 85 bills targeting DEI programs and colleges have been introduced with 14 signed into law and recently some companies have been cutting their initiatives as well. That's despite a poll saying that 71% of people think they quote, create a positive workplace culture.